Guys, I wasn't actually really going to vlog today, but um, at first we didn't think we were going to go to the museum because I have to work tonight, but I realized that he's so grumpy, I'm not going to be able to record in silence like I have to do for videos I do for other channels with him awake. <laughs> so we decided we're going to take him to the kids museum, and if he's not too sad or grumpy, then we're going to walk next door to the health museum for one of those bodies exhibits. Are those the real human bodies at that one? I don't think so. I think this is a replica. Yeah, I think this is replicas. I don't know if it's the one that travels with like their real body. I totally want to see that, but I don't know. I'll have to look it up and let y'all know, but um, I just wanted to share a cute video. See y'all. His tooth. Oh, what's wrong? Where's Elmo? Oh, he dropped Elmo. Oh, Jesus. And Buzz. Um, he is like where his tooth is up here. This tooth is like bulging almost to where it looks like one of those cysts that come before a tooth but not purple. It is just bulging and like you can see the tooth right here at the bottom. He's in so much pain because of it though. So we're trying to do stuff to distract him and like but at night it's just been really hard. So we decided we're gonna go ahead and go to the museum and try to keep his mind off the pain and give him, you know, medicine around the times he can have it and just, but I figured distraction is the best, best method we can use right now. So we're gonna go do that. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Double museum adventures today. Don't throw it at people. <laughs> Careful where you throw. See, he can climb it. I told you. Come here. Come here. Lean him back some so he doesn't fall back on his head and hurt it. Woo! Good job! No? You don't want to or are you going to? Yes, no, maybe. Stressing me out. You could fall. Okay, never mind, Daddy. Hi! Hi! Speed racer! <laughs> Hi! And he's off. It kind of makes like a... Oh, that was your ring hitting the metal. Oh, <laughs> that was my ring. <laughs> he loves driving. <laughs> Careful. Swing your legs out. Are you getting out? There you go. There you go. And the wheel. <laughs> He's leaving.
He's so brave now compared to the first time we brought him. Baby, you have to do this. Remember? He's done. You gotta do that, remember? Now walk, walk. Now walk, walk. Baby, you gotta push it forward and walk, walk. There you go, walk, walk. There you go. He's like, no, this is weird. Water park. There. What do you see? Dirt? Yeah. You see the baby jacks? He's like, why are they stuck in a bubble? <laughs> oh. Look at the poop. We were getting poop like this in our yard for the longest, and we thought we had like some kind of, what did you think it was a rat? Forever. You thought it was a rat in our yard, but it was a toad when we Googled. Mm, possum poop looks like cat poop, but sick cat poop. <gasps> See? <laughs> See the water? <laughs> wow. Having a milk break, and uh, we're gonna head literally right next door to the Ch health museum. That's the health museum. Yeah. So <laughs> museum closed. We should have come here first. Oops. Well, that sucks. I really wanted to see that body works thing, and it tomorrow's the last day I think of the exhibit. So. I guess we'll have to catch it next time because usually it's really expensive to get in to see it but the health museum had tickets it's like included with your ticket which like at the natural museum they don't do that so it's um it was just like 10 bucks to see it a person <sighs> we are home and it was a little sad we didn't get to finish our adventure but i think it was probably for the best because he's very tired He's been staying up to like 7.30 and at 6, but I'm just going to let him go down to go to sleep now because he's just so tired. We don't make him stay awake when he's like this. He just ate some dinner. So I'm just going to end the vlog. It's just a short little family day vlog for you guys. Um, yeah, tonight I'm filming, so I always have to wait till Jackson goes to sleep. And then I do my little weekend kind of pickup clean routine. So it's like a quick little weekend routine. I guess I'll just film it for you guys. It said y'all are like super into the cleaning videos. A lot of you guys started following me a long time ago when I did like spring cleaning videos, like before power hour and cleaning videos were cool. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna share my like little weekend routine, pickup routine. And then I'm gonna do like my weekly routine too, but I'll try to have that out this week, but I'm gonna record it tonight. Can you say goodbye friends? Say I'm gonna go night. Bye. Bye-bye. See you later. Bye-bye. Ah. He's like, I'm going to go. He usually says bye-bye, but no, no. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, we'll bye. see you in our next video. See you in our next video. Bye. <laughs> usually that does it. Mm. Bye. Mm. <laughs> bye, guys. Hey, guys. So this is a weird add-on to my vlog from the other day. I have some news. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, my MacBook Pro, which the first three years, two to three years, it was fine. And then it just went to crap. And I know it's not me. Like it's constantly like burned out two hard drives. There's a cable in it that connects stuff and it's burned out three times. Um, and so that happened again. And I didn't lose anything. Thank the Lord. But Justin, um, had to, we had to order more cables for it and it has to ship like you can't buy it here in Houston and I am on a deadline for um, my the channel I am a contributor to and um, you know we talked about it and I'm like I'm so sick of this with this MacBook Pro and it's not just me I think for YouTube it's just asking too much of it um, I've had too many problems with it and 
there's all these like people that annoy me like my um family member that's like well i've had my macbook pro forever and nothing's wrong with it and i want to be like yeah because you probably like sit around and surf the internet and look at truck crap like you're not working that machine you know and i know it's just not me but like it's not just me because other youtubers are complaining about it. i think Erin Williams just had a problem with her MacBook Pro. In fact, I tweeted her because I was like, oh my god, that's what happened to me last time. I lost everything, though. This time I didn't, thank god. But we finally decided to just buy a, um, I, iMac? What? Yeah, iMac. <laughs> Get to look at the box. You guys, this thing is huge. Um, it was a big investment, but we talked about it, and Justin's like, YouTube is important. You are able to pay for all Jackson stuff and so sometimes you just have to make investments so I went ahead and invested in an iMac it really wasn't as expensive as I thought it would be in the past I've tried to like not buy them because I I don't know I thought they were like like six thousand dollars for some reason I must have been looking at a really crazy one I mean it was not cheap but it was not 6k so you guys are gonna die when you see the screen I can't even like it is huge I can't like I'm trying to figure out how to show y'all how big the screen is like y'all know my if y'all have an Ikea desk like this you know how big it is it's 27 inches y'all see how the laundry I have to do it's 27 inches and um it's freaking huge like it's insane I can't even with the box just even the box is crazy I'm like oh, I can't y'all and like it's huge it's crazy it's like a freaking TV it's so weird like I just edited on it for the first time and I was like this is crazy but it's it's nice it's gonna take some getting used to um, we are going to have to drill a hole in my desk for it though so there's no like so the keyboard and the mouse are wireless but right now the keyboard's charging so that won't always be there um but this right here and it, it runs on wi-fi which is great because i don't need a router or i don't need to plug it into the router which is a plus and it actually is way more stable than i thought it would be but so we're going to drill a hole through my desk like a small one for the cable to go through so the Jackson can't you know pull it or whatever um and then uh we're also got we got safety straps so that we can strap my computer to the my computer my desk to the wall when I am not using it so it and it's docked into place when we're just using the playroom um Jackson can't tip it over on himself we never thought Jackson would be able to tip it over himself, and it's never acted like it was going to tip. But you guys, Jackson, as tall as this desk is, it comes up to, like, my, the top of my thigh, like, where it meets your hip joint. And I'm 5'7". Like, it is tall. It's a very tall desk. Jackson can climb it now. Like, he pulls and pulls and pulls and pulls, and he can get to his waist and, like, the top of him bent over the desk. It's insane. Um... I'll try to catch him on camera one day but so we we're gonna strap it because I mean if he knocked over the computer it is what it is but I don't want like the desk falling on him even actually the computer actually the computer's not that heavy but it still scares me so I'm trying to find a way to actually like fasten the computer to the um desk if that makes sense but so like the difference between a pc and a mac if you don't know is I don't have a um let see, like, can you see how big, can you see my little hand? So you can actually see the size. I don't actually have a little hand, y'all. So you can actually see, like, the freaking size of this beast. Um, I don't have to have a tower or anything, which I really like, so I'm really hoping this works out. It was quite an investment, but I think it was worth, like Justin said, like, <sighs> YouTube and my other jobs on YouTube, not necessarily with my channel, have really helped us take care of Jackson, and I just need to invest in my future in YouTube, you know. So, um, plus it's not like I'm one of those YouTubers where our only income is YouTube. Those people stress me out. I'm like, what are you going to do? Do you have a retirement plan? You know one day YouTube's going to end. You guys, when I watch family vloggers and that's all I do, all I do, especially the young ones, is I'm like, you're not even getting a degree or something. I get so stressed out about it. That's probably silly because it's not my life, but I stress for them because I'm like, 
one day YouTube's not going to be cool anymore. And I hope they're building, I'm sure they're building skills with editing and filming and stuff, but I hope that they're building other things for themselves to where they're going to have income because if something happened with YouTube, it's like you have a mortgage and you have children, you know, it's just like crazy to me. Um, it stresses me out. That's like totally off topic. But anyways, this is going to be a long vlog because of this, but I just want to give you guys an update on why the vlog didn't come out. So I'm just trying to finish the videos I have to, and I don't know when this is going to come out. I don't know. I'll see you guys later. Bye. <laughs>